Imagine you're running a pizza bakery where you offer a variety of different pizzas, including vegetarian, vegan, and also gluten-free options. Given a certain time window, you know which pizzas you need to bake and also when these pizzas need to be ready. Now your task is to um, decide which pizza to bake in which oven, because you have two ovens to choose from, and also to find a schedule for all pizzas. And you have quite special ovens. They can accommodate more than one pizza at a time, but once you've started baking a batch of pizzas, uh, you cannot remove one pizza and continue baking the others. So all need to be processed exactly at the same time. Also, uh, you don't want to combine uh, pizzas that are vegetarian with non-vegetarian, vegan with non-vegan, and uh, gluten-free and non-gluten-free. So um, you need to form batches of pizzas that have the same attribute. Also, you need to consider transition times uh, between batches of different attrib attributes. So for instance, if you had a, an oven containing non-gluten-free pizzas and want to bake a batch of gluten-free pizzas, you need to perform a very thorough cleaning of the oven before you continue. This takes time and also produces costs. So this is a quite tricky scheduling problem um, that we call the oven scheduling problem. Now, if you want to hear in which area this uh, problem actually appears, please uh, come and listen to our talk entitled Minimizing Cumulative Batch Processing Time for an Industrial Oven Scheduling Problem. There you will see how we model this problem and we will also tell you about the results of our extensive experimental evaluation. Thank you.